Now, what in the carnival is going on here? So in today's episode of Dumbest Criminals, we have four recent carnival passengers that are now behind bars after trying to indulge in an illegal vacation. They thought they could drink to their heart's content. They thought they could enjoy all of the Shaq's Big Chicken, Guy's Burgers. However, after using multiple fraudulent credit cards, they are now in jail. Make sure you pay attention to this video because this is what not to do if you decide to commit a crime. By the way, before we dive into this epic fail of a story, a couple quick announcements. By this time next week, I will be on another cruise. I'm heading back out to sea. I actually have about three cruises between now and the end of the year. You guys want to know my whereabouts, you can find that out on my Patreon for as little as $2 a month. You also get other benefits like direct access to me. If you want to ask me a question, you want help with something, I got your back over there. Also, if you haven't already, make sure you go subscribe to my new channel. We're already 4,000 subscribers strong, the Travel News Channel. I'll be talking about topics similar to what I do here on the ship life, but everything that that isn't regarding cruising so make sure you guys go check it out i promise it'll be epic i think so four criminals well i guess at the time they weren't really criminals well technically they were because they had already committed the crime they did before they even got on the ship decided to take a cruise of a lifetime out of miami illegally of course using fraudulent credit cards between the dates of october 29th through november 5th on carnival's newest operating cruise ship the carnival celebration taking a cruise over to the caribbean these four passengers are all around 30 years of age living between tennessee and georgia they decided to live in up on the cruise spending tens of thousands of dollars they were using multiple credit cards while on board the carnival celebration during their seven day cruise and this of course would flag carnival system when the passengers were asked to present an actual physical copy of that credit card they couldn't do so and just like that it was discovered that they were using fraudulent aka stolen credit cards of course once the carnival celebration arrived to miami once the cruise had concluded authorities were waiting and they arrested all four of the passengers charging each of them with multiple multiple counts of fraudulent use of a credit card and grand theft. It even gets more interesting. You come to find out that one of the men that were arrested, Dominic Howard, spent over $20,000 of stolen credit card money at the casino. He also, once arrested, had about $11,000 in his luggage in cash. What's even crazier is that Chanel Howard, by the way, just to be clear, it is not confirmed as to if the Howards are connected, if they're husband, wife, brother, sister, let alone the entire four set piece here how they're all connected or if they even are connected but nevertheless chanel howard also tried to book her cruise with a stolen credit card it got denied but somehow she ended up making it on board this carnival cruise aside from dominic howard the rest of the group spent anywhere between two to twelve thousand dollars each while on the cruise i'm assuming they were expecting nobody to notice either way justice has been served and the day is saved all of these now criminals are sitting in a jail cell over in miami each with tens of thousand dollars of bond amounts now there is a lot that could be said here but this is a typical case of what i like to call self snitching if you're doing illegal activities maybe you shouldn't be so loud about it by that i mean you have stolen credit cards you know you do you were able to make it on a cruise and sail on your merry way you then continue to use said stolen money to spend tens of thousands of dollars thinking it's not going to get somebody's attention well it did and now you're in the predicament that you are of course, all of this is justified. They deserve every single bit of punishment they are going to get. Just do keep in mind for all of you out there that maybe don't cruise too often, if you are conducting illegal activity or, for example, you have a warrant out for your arrest, while the cruise lines don't necessarily do a background check on you, there is a lot of paperwork and details and even governments and customs involved whenever you decide to take a cruise. Meaning, if you got a warrant, for example, your name is going to get flagged and you'll be arrested upon arrival whenever you get back over to the home port. And same like this situation, you decide to use stolen credit cards there is going to be some suspicion with carnival system they're going to flag they're going to do some research and they come to conclude that you're using multiple credit cards they're going to ask you to present said credit cards if you can't produce well now the police are going to get involved and you're going to be in a little bit of trouble i'm also curious if there is a way that carnival could have maybe a little bit of a better system as far as how they operate because i'm curious as to how somebody was using a stolen credit card to book a cruise which declined but somehow they were still able to board the ship meanwhile you have other people that are using their hard-earned money with their actual credit card to book a cruise and they leave something like a drink package in the cart and because of that they are potentially denied the cruise i know my small brain can't comprehend i do know it's a lot of details and in this digital world and online and all there's a lot that needs to be done and there are things that simply cannot be done anywho that's what i got let me know your thoughts in the comment section below hit that like button on your way out subscribe to this channel subscribe to my other channel the travel news channel and as usual i love and appreciate every single one of you i'll see you later take it easy